Hi, welcome to The Gamesplainer. I'm Jeff The Gamesplainer and today I'm gamesplaining Between Two Cities. Between Two Cities is a tile laying city building game. Everyone starts with a pile of seven cards randomly drawn from the box. Have a look at them all, choose two, pass them to the player on your left, indicating by putting the little city marker on top of it. Once everyone has done that, you'll have five tokens underneath each city marker, and on your next turn, you will take from that pile to then play into your cities again. The two cards that you have, you then decide uh, between you and the player on your left and right as to which tiles are going to go into which city. So you might put this one on this side in the green city, and this one on this side in the grey and white city. Um, they will also be placing a tile into each of the cities from each side. So each of you are working on two cities simultaneously. It's in your best interest to build both of them up at the same time. As the final score comes down to the lowest scoring city out of your pairs is the one that you score with. Whoever has the highest score at the end is the winner of their lowest city. Play continues in that order, taking the next five cards, selecting another two, placing them the same way, and then passing them on until you are handed three cards, at which point you will play two of them and one of them will get discarded. The limits of your city is four by four, or four over here. Once you have six tiles in each of your cities, we then go to the second round. In the second round, you get three of these double side or duplex tiles, noticing that some of them are vertical, some of them are horizontal. Placement always happens with that icon in the top left. So when you're trying to place them in your city, you're still stuck to the four by four. You're only gonna place two of these, one, of, one in each city. Same um, deal with selecting them as previously. So to select two and place the discarded one under the city token of the player next to you. You'll then place them within the sizes of your city, noting that you can't go outside the four by four. So this guy can't go there because that would make it five wide. It needs to stay within the four by four and noticing that every tile that's been laid so far is been, has shared an edge with another tile. Placing diagonally is not a legal placement for your tiles. The third round happens with another seven tiles, just like the first round, except this time you're passing the tiles to your right hand side rather than to your left. Once all of those tiles have been placed, we then score every city for each thing. The scoring is according to this card here. It shows each of the six different building types and what scores can be scored for them. I will go deep into the scoring of this in the next video. Um, it's worthwhile having an understanding of this before you play the game. Uh, if you can give a little bit of information that before the first game, that would be great, but it's really necessary to understand all six things. So carry on to part two. If you have any games that you wish to be gamesplained, please email me at thegamesplainer at gmail.com. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram to see what games I've been playing. And until next time, enjoy gaming.